hi guys welcome back to my channel um so yes as you guys can see by the title it will be my april favorites i know i'm kind of late um but as you guys can see i pretty started my youtube channel so i did want to include my april favorites because i have a couple that i've been wanting to mention to you guys and i just definitely recommend them i will link everything below um so yes if you guys are interested then please Keep on okay, so I'm just going to start um, just randomly, you guys. Okay, I'm not going to go browse, face, no, none of that. Um, I'm just going to start super random. First things first, I want to mention the Aquaphor. You guys, oh my goodness. This thing, ever since Amanda Essing, um, she recommended it. I have, like, non-stop using it. It moisturizes your lips like no other. Like, I love it. Definitely recommend this Aquaphor. Another palette that I have not stopped touching for the past two months, actually, it's the Anastasia. The Modern Renaissance Palette. Um, everything about it, you guys, as you guys can see, beautiful. Um, my kind of color is just neutral, warm. I love it. I love it. It has good two glitter, and I just... I definitely recommend you guys very very like um very pigmented one of my like my favorite ones is the burnt orange literally use this mostly like every day you guys i mean like oh come on i don't know if you guys can see it but oh you guys i love it i've been using this literally every day like i go to work every day so like almost every day i should say um and i love blush i love it and morphe 9b oh my gosh literally this is like like the only thing you need basically like i mean guys come on my two favorite is these two right here this one and this one um they're just so awesome this one too is really really pretty um everything you guys every single color in this palette i definitely recommend it it's just so pretty you guys could use that on an like everyday basis i definitely recommend it for you guys talk about highlight i mean my favorite thing of course i mean highlight so the one i'm wearing here which is one of my favorites it's been like oh my ride or die the um anastasia so hollywood oh my goodness you guys like i mean come on hello right um i love it i love it so much like very it's popping y'all it's popping y'all have it y'all get me right okay um anastasia that glow glow kit oh like that's it when i seen it i was shocked i swear i was shocked like what like what you guys like seriously like bubbly dripping in gold like oh my goodness you guys i mean literally look at these babies right here like oh mm -mm -mm. like look at that um, so yeah, this is my baby, ride or die. Let's go with lipsticks. Okay, the one who was not gonna go in order, right? Um, one of my favorite lipsticks at the moment, like months, months, like it has been at least three months. It's 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 a combo and just like like by them. So the Kat Von G bow and arrow. Oh my god, by far, by far one of the best nudes ever. Like you guys, no joke. I mean, it's such a beautiful, beautiful color. Look at this. Like, oh my gosh, I love it. I use it every single day. I kid you not. If I'm going to go for a nude color, it's that for sure. Then I had to add a lip gloss, of course, you guys. My Kylie one from um, Like. Um, oh my goodness, just so pretty. Um, one of my favorites lip gloss that I have actually bought. Um... It's just so pretty. You guys can use it by itself. Very pigmented. It lasts long. I swear. Um, it's this one right here. Like, oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. Um, but yes. Um, lasts like literally uh, such a long time. Like, I went out. Probably started getting ready at 8. And I came home like 4 in the morning. I swear to God. I, it was on my fucking lips. It was on my lips. Okay. Mm, gorgeous okay um eyeshadow i am gonna include just a single one it's by ColourPop. um i i mean come on millionaire um this one is very known very known you guys this is like 
literally i've hit pan y'all i have hit pan like i can literally pop that in my eyelid i'm good to go glam no glam i love it it's bomb it's freaking bomb and i definitely definitely recommend it um so yes let's see okay setting sprays um i don't have the urban decay with me i just ran out not that long ago so i do have to go get one but it's one of the best ones i have ever used but oh my gosh one i love coconut anything coconut you guys like that's it you don't gotta say nothing else like nothing else coconut for me mm, that's it i'm done i'm getting it so the dry cosmetics lay all day i use the cucumber jasmine um and i forgot the other scents they're all fucking amazing i'm sorry my language oops they're all freaking amazing okay super super long lasting very hydrating very very hydrating when i found out that the coconut one you guys can we just talk about that one like it's the same thing i just like i swear i could bathe myself every morning in it like oh my gosh like too fresh and oh i swear like i could just right um but yes it's so freaking good you guys so freaking good um like i just want to mm, mm, yes give it to me um ooh. um but yeah you guys this one i definitely definitely recommend it if you guys haven't tried the dry cosmetics stay all day setting sprays please do like what are you guys waiting for a little bit of skincare right um just a few more products and that's it i promise i'm I'm trying for this not to be a long video. Okay, I bought this. Maybe it has been almost three weeks. I'm not going to lie. Almost three weeks. Um, but it's the Tarte's um, C Brightener Eye Treatment. Uh, it's their eye cream. Oh my gosh, you guys. I've been using the Clinique one um, the past few months. But this one, like, I've used it for the past three weeks. And I freaking love it. Like, oh my gosh. Just the consistency of it, um, the way it applies, the way it just wears in, you know, in your, you know, like under your eyes. Um, it really, really helps with concealer. Not only that, but like it brightens. I swear it brightens up and it just like less, way, way less drying um, than my other one, which I freaking love about it. Um, so, yes, I definitely recommend it for those who haven't tried it. Um, it's really good stuff. Um, my moisturizer that I've been using for the past, I'm going to say a, exactly a month, I think. Um, it's the Believe, the True Cream Aqua Bomb. Uh, I know there's two different kinds, but I have this one, which is the, like the normal to oily skin, not the dry one. Um, I did try the dry one. I freaking love it. But, um, it was kind of too moisturizing for me. Um, so I tried this one and I really, 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 really have been liking it so far. Um just it doesn't like it like i don't feel kind of tacky you know like the moisturizer kind of make you feel tacky it's like none of that um it's just it's hydrating at the same time and so that's what i like i know i'm normal to oil you know like normal to oily but i still like my face to feel hydrated um no matter what and that one does that job um it really does moisturize my face i love it before my makeup application it really helps with it um so three more items let's talk about, about mascara so the tart the camera lights lashes one this one is really 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 good like i i've been using the benefit roller lash i look like i still love that one for my bottom lashes i don't use the tart one for the um for my bottom lashes but for the top you guys oh my gosh like so freaking bomb like my sister she you know she thought that i was wearing falsies i'm like what <laughs> i'm sorry what like no um it's that tart one girl so you should get it um but yeah i it's super good like i do like two coats um each eye and like i'm good to go like on the days that i don't want to wear makeup like i literally put that and like that's it like i mean like that's all i need like i freaking love it i really really love it like um even like the wand of it like it's not fat but it's not too thin it's just perfect like um if it's like really good here too like oh um and i like it because it it's really black i don't know if you guys mean like know what i mean by that but you know how some mascaras are like it's black but it's not really black black this one is really really black black um so yes all right um eyeliner oh my gosh it's probably been a year i'm not gonna lie 
but again i just started my youtube channel so i have to mention it i have to because this i have not touched a freaking liquid eyeliner or anything besides this one i've been using the kat von d the tattoo liner um oh this one is freaking bomb like it's like a felt tip kind of ish um really really pointy really 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 good to do the wing eyeliner very very dark sometimes i do run it over with the nyc that one might still my ride or die i think i heard that it was discontinued um oh, which is so bad because i really really love it i only have like literally very little bit so gotta save it right um so yes um besides that i have one more item which is a lip liner literally i wear it mostly on every single lip combo no matter what if i do wear eyeliner i mean eyeliner liner um lip liner is gonna be my mac one like you guys mac sore oh my goodness it's just like the perfect just like the perfect neutral color like it has a little bit of pink in it but it's like a little bit of mauve -y. um and it's that one right there um so pretty it applies super smooth on your lips um i love this one with whirl that one was oh my gosh so pretty so pretty any like literally any lip combo i don't do it really with like nude 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 but any pink any mauve and like past that it's i gotta use my max or lip liner um so yes um i think that's pretty much it yes i think that's pretty much it in regards of makeup and skincare wise but i wanted to add a little bit something um i know casey i believe she started it correct me if i'm wrong but i love her oh my god i love her um but yeah she started the music favorites i believe she did so i'm gonna jump on that because i have like um quite a few songs that i like i love music i love it um yes i'm paisa i'm super paisa like don't get me wrong but i love all type of music i swear like i love it all except for like that screamo like no offense to anybody okay just not me it's just not me that screamo and um rock eh, you know no i mean alternative rock is different but yes anyways let's jump right onto it okay so <laughs> So this one is called Despacitos, the remix is with Justin Bieber. Oh, oh, I can't find it. Una aventura, it's by Maluma. There it is. Falsas mentiras, um, of course, featuring Osuna. I hear guys coming. When they play that, and I'm not like, like, you know, like at a paisa club, and they play that shit, forget about it. Like, I lose it. I swear to God, I freaking lose it. Like, oh, I've been obsessed. Obsessed. Oh, no más. El Fantasma Mi 45, you guys. Oh, if you like Mexican music, this is a song, y'all. I'm telling y'all, this is a song. Oh my gosh. This song, so yes. These have been my favorite um, at the moment. I have more, but I don't want to make this too long because literally I have one. I have a whole freaking playlist that nonstop on a row every day. Like, yeah. Um, but you guys, this is it for now for the, my April favorites. Um, if you guys have any questions, any comments, please just comment down below. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Um, so yeah, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it and see you in my next video. Bye.